And welcome to another episode of the Tiger Review. I'm Stuart Reserve. And I'm Radar. And today we've got Jack Daniels Watermelon. <laughs> <laughs> Jack Daniels Watermelon Punch. 4.8% alcohol by volume and it says Responsible B21 Plus. That's some Yoda stuff right there. Um, yeah. We had the other one recently and it was pretty good. And whoa, it's very, very red. Um, uh, especially in this in this glass, it's incredibly red in this glass. Not as red in that one though. It's the same color. Someday we're gonna have to. It's the same color as the fruit punch one. I wonder why that is. It is. It, wait, it what? Is. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, wait. It's exactly the same color. No, this one is a bit cloudier. <laughs> yes. All right. Well. We've gotten that out of the way. I'm sorry. Go ahead and give it a smell. It is highly carbonated. It smells exactly the same. No, this one has more of a watermelon smell to it. Go ahead. And and if you mean by that, if that if by that you mean a slight absence of scent. Then yes, it has a bit more of a watermelon smell to it. These are probably the exact same thing. This smells like exactly the same thing. All right, well, let's, uh, <laughs> let's shall we? Let's... This actually does have a different taste to it. It does. I thought it was going to be the same thing. That. This actually has like a watermelon taste to it. It not does. Like, not you know artificial watermelon. A bit watermelon. like a slice of watermelon. Yeah. Yeah. Right up which, next to the rind when it's getting close to the white bit. Yeah, which, you know, that's actually kind of surprising. You know, that. Yeah. Uh. uh that's, yeah. That's not bad at all. No, much better than the previous one. Uh. And I think it's because it tastes more like, you know, um, it's a watermelon, you know? Yeah. Um, I was expecting this to be just like the most artificial thing in the world, but it actually tastes kind of like watermelon. Well, what, uh, what would you rate this, Radar? Um, I would rate this as a six, just because it tastes like a thing that actually exists. Uh, would you recommend it? Yes. Yes, I would. All right, well, I, uh, I'm going to go with you on that one and give it a six as well. It's, you know, pretty good, you know, because they has actually tastes like an actual watermelon, you know, and not like watermelon candy type stuff. And yeah, and I I would actually recommend this as well. You know, it's, it was surprising. Yeah, it smelled about the same as the other one. It's but not too awful expensive either. It's not. Yeah. All right. Well, that's our episode. If there's anything you'd like to see, leave a comment down below. I'm Stuart Reserve. And I'm Radar. Thanks, Thanks for, for watching. watching.